Hey guys, don't forget to click like and subscribe to the channel. Also follow us on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. Thanks again. do a maiden flight, remaiden flight. Here we go. I don't feel good. Yeah. almost a pound of weight to the nose just to get it to uh, to balance properly so here we go taking off hope it goes well a little gurgly there tails up that's good well it's definitely uh it flies heck of a lot better I'm flying at full throttle though, so I need to land it and tune it a bit. Unless it lands itself out, and it is. Here we go. So we are coming around. Hey Ralph. I'm gonna bring it in for a landing and see if we can't tune it. But it is definitely uh, much better. Except the engine doesn't cut off on us. Why we left. Looks good though. Damn, I'm, but I'm butchering this. <laughs> All right. Sorry. That's an edit. Yeah, it's not good. It's a new air and I was having CG problems with it. And I had to add almost a pound of weight to the nose. Really? Yeah, so, and it, it's just on the CG right now. So I wouldn't want to bring it back out. It's flying good. It's leaned itself out. It's got a daily 20 in there. It needs to be uh, leaned out a lot more. But other than that, it's flying good. I'm pretty happy with it. It's really smooth. <laughs> Jeff's missing out. He should be here in a minute, though. Who? Uh, Jeff. Jeff. Yep. We'll do a low speed. So it should be uneventful, as long as the engine's still running. There we go. Nice. Okay. There we go. Uh, <laughs> That's a little bouncy. I could have done better. I probably will next time. Like it. Yeah, it's a it's a really good flying airplane. Now I know a lot of people are gonna say, but you don't have the wheel pants on there. Well, you know we got grass out here. Sometimes yeah. the wheel pants uh, don't help you take off. All right, taking off from right to left. There you go. We'll climb and get some altitude. Let it lean itself out. Like I said, this engine has a lot more power to give, but we're just not there yet. And I also have a master air screw prop on there that has the squared ends, which is not very efficient. So it's not like a, uh, a Zor or, or a, um, a vest prop. 
So I'll switch that over too. But. Shows up really well in the sky. It's an RV8, so it does good. Engine seems to be happy at full throttle. That was test number one right there, the roll. So that's good. And also the engine needs to run too. It hasn't really had any run time on it other than maybe about 30 minutes. So getting it up there and flying it is the best way to break it in. Yes, I'm doing better. Shows up really well. Yeah. Yeah, the sky's good for this right now. It really is. Very aerobatic, very ad agile. And this is the Seagulls Models RV8. I like it. It flies good. I bought this off of uh, Doug. Oh, yeah. We'll switch it over uh, high rates on the ailerons and now that I'm a little bit more comfortable with it. It's flying like the CG is good. It could use maybe an, another ounce. But it doesn't need it. Tell that engine's breaking in too because it's got a lot more. It sounds power. a lot better now. It does, right? Some people choose to break them in, you know, on the ground and run them in. But if you if you read some of the uh, what's on the manual, it tells you that it's best to fly them because it's not under like a static load. It's actually under a true load when it's flying. Less likely to overheat too with airflow. Right. Yep. Yeah, pretty good I like it it's definitely a keeper in, in the uh, the colors different you know you don't see that a lot yeah. mighty close to those trees back there all right so this is going really well super happy about that the remaiden is good it's not going to be very much of anything, but all right, I'll take it. That's not bad. With that prop, there's not much to be expected. <clears throat> all right, so we'll set it for a landing. and we'll bring it in. Right. Now that it's running good, the throttle back. Let it settle on in. Nice. RV4s and RV8s are known for their good landings very uneventful they settle in really nice they glide really nice so we'll see if we can't score a nice landing on this one a little bouncy there a little bouncy but i'll take it a couple landings yep you can see that landing gear too is is flex it flexes quite a bit on landing i noticed uh, not bad i'll take two landings don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel Seagulls model RV8 is a Keeper Daily 20.